Today's Bible study is titled Jerusalem Council Summary. In our dashboard study of Galatians, thus far, Paul has been building the case for grace with a historical commentary regarding his encounters with Peter, the rest of the twelve, James the Lord's half-brother, and some false brethren, ultimately in and around the Jerusalem Council of Acts 15. So far, we've heard Paul note his Jerusalem presentation of gospel, which I preach among the Gentiles, was conducted privately to them which were of reputation, namely Peter, the other kingdom apostles, and James. In addition, Paul also referred to the leaders of these before whom he presented the gospel of the grace of God, as these who seemed to be somewhat and these seemed to be pillars. And the student of the word will ask why? Adding this all up, you see that the results of Paul's presentation of the gospel of grace, before these resulted in. Number 1. These in conference added nothing to me. Number 2. They saw that the gospel of the uncircumcision was committed unto me. Number 3. They perceived the grace that was given unto me, such that they they gave to me, and Barnabas the right hands of fellowship, and, number four. As a result, they determined that Paul had been selected by the Lord to go unto the heathen and they unto the circumcision. Whether the twelve and company realized that God had concluded Israel in unbelief for rejection of the witness of the twelve and the little flock, Romans 11 verse 32, is not stated, but by this time it appears it had certainly occurred. Regardless, they obviously concluded that there had been a major dispensational change as we will see as we go forward. The question is, what have you realized and concluded? Believer do not just read the word and do not just listen to others teach the word. Instead, study to shew thyself approved unto God, a workman that needeth not to be ashamed, rightly dividing the word of truth. 2 Timothy 2 verse 15, KJV, and ask why. As a believer, this is your instructions and obligation. Thank you for listening to this Bible study today.